Hello, this is H.C. Bailey, and welcome back to Let's Play Chrono Trigger. Today, we're finally going to end the evil reign of terror of the Zeal Kingdom. But first, it's boss time! And if you had trouble defeating one golem, well, it gets worse. We have to kill two of them this time. Fortunately, I have the almighty Luminaire! Ow! Okay. There we go. Let's get that going. We want a charm from them. But yeah, essentially same strategy as before, except uh, this time, well, I, I want to use Luminaire because it's more powerful. Of course, we want to get uh, the magic tabs from them. Ow! They had to hit the same character again. Ah, oh, man. I didn't pace myself. I thought, uh, I thought Chrono's turn would move a little faster than that. Okay, come on, Chrono. Come on. Okay. I wanted to make sure I got that going before they could copy a fire attack or something, because they'll both use it on you, and that just gets very unfriendly. Of course... Ah, oh, come on, Isla. Don't you have the charm top, top equipped? Oh, whatever. Man, these guys are a little faster than before. Eventually, once I charm all the items from them, I will want to um, have Isla use a lot piece, because you want to keep your HP above... Uh, I'd say 300 would be pretty good. You could probably get away with 200, but just to be on the safe side for when they copy Dalton, because we're both going to kill them both at the same time, obviously. Alright, there we go. And if you want to take them out one at a time for some reason, um, you could also use Marley's and Isla's Cube Toss dual tech. That one is really nice. But, obviously, you'd have to kill them off one at a time then, and I don't think that's a good idea. I think it's just better just to kill them both at once and be done with it. Oh, Luminaire is so good. It's the most powerful single tech in the game, uh, as far as raw base power, that is. Unfortunately, Chrono's magic stat is not so hot, so other single techs like Luca's Flare or... Um, even Robo's Shack, because I've given him all my magic tabs, those will be stronger than Luminaire. Those are their uh, ultimate techs, by the way. Alright, we got him. And our HP is high enough to survive a counterattack. Okay, two counterattacks, why not? And we got both magic tabs, which I will be using on Robo shortly. Yay, we learned some more stuff. Okay, Dalton. Let's... Uh, Golem boss? Uh-oh. Oh, well, yeah, obviously. You're, you're kind of right next to Lavos. Or, well, the Mammon machine, which is stealing his energy, but... Oh, well, I want to be immortal, so I'm going to let you guys go. Okay, well, I'm going to rearrange my party, use magic tabs, heal up, and be right back. Alright, we're all set and ready to go. So let's stop the Mammon Machine, and I guess that will help against Lavos. And that new decided to commit suicide for no apparent reason. I guess he's afraid of the Mammon Machine and Lavos. Okay, so uh, where's the switch? How do we turn this thing off? What do we care about Scala for? What'd she ever do for us? And why are you helping her? I thought, well, who's the good guy and the bad guy? A red knife? What did Masa and Mune have to do with that? I thought it was called the ruby knife. Hey, that looks just like the Masa Mune sword. But that didn't do anything to it, though. Yeah, you have to just flip the little switch at the bottom there, and that'll turn it off. Couldn't you just stop it, Scala? I mean, I thought you were the one in charge here. Oh, 
crap. Okay, well, it's time for the final battle against Lavos. Ready or not? We've got, well, uh, enough techs, I suppose, so let's give it a shot. Oh, what the hell? I didn't even get a freaking turn. Give me a chance. It actually is possible to defeat Lavos here, but not in this game. <laughs> Maybe in a new game plus, but what's the prophet doing here? Whoa! It's Magus! How the hell he changes clothes so fast? Uh, yeah. Well, he is a wizard after all, but what's he doing here? And what is... He doesn't seem to like Lavos very much either, but... Why were you trying to summon him to destroy all mankind then? Well, I mean, he is from 600 AD, so... I suppose he would be sort of a prophet, I guess. How can you treat your own daughter like that? I mean, what kind of foster home do you think she's going to put you in now when you get old and gray? Yeah! Get him, Lavos! Get him! Get him! He turned Glenn into a frog! Whoa! He's pretty strong! Whoa, what's that? Well, that didn't seem to do much. They never really explained what Magus was trying to do there, you know? I mean, I guess it was made from the Dreamstone or something, and he thought it was going to do something to him, but... Oh, no! What's he going to do now? Oh, he's going to suck Magus and Scala and eat them up, I guess. Well, we have to stop him! Well, yeah, we have Luminaire! Hey, whoa, Chrono, just, just use Luminaire. Hey, come on! Chrono, what are you waiting for? What are you doing? No! He might be okay. Hey, it's the pendant. What the? What? Oh my god! Well, no, probably not now. They killed off the main character! Right before our eyes! How can they do that? They even showed him being vaporized to death. Wow. I, you can't kill off the main character. I, maybe at the end of the game, like, maybe he sacrifices his life to save the world, but the world isn't saved. I mean, Lavos is waking up, like, a few 10,000 years ahead of time. I mean, what are we going to do now? We don't have Chrono. We don't have Luminaire. I mean, well, I guess at least we can get sent to safety. Oh, what the hell? How are we not supposed to hate her? She just killed my boy toy. Hey, don't send Magus away. He's a bad guy. What's his deal with Lavos anyway? Can't you get out of there, Scala? And Scala dies along with the Ocean Palace, and that's it. We never see her again. Oh boy. Well, I guess that's it for the Zeal Kingdom, huh? Ow! I love this scene. It's so cool seeing the end of the world like that again. This is what we had for cinematics back in the day. Oh crap. Can you fly? I don't think so. But what about the magic that was suspending it in the air? How are you going to survive now, guys? trying to figure out what you call people from Zeal, but oh well. 
What are the Earthbound ones going to do now? It's a tidal wave! Let's go outside and check it out! Well, that's it. It's the end of the world. Labos wins, Kratos dead, and that's it. I hope you've enjoyed Let's Play Chrono Trigger. This is H.C. Bailey signing off. Have a good day. Nah, I'm just kidding. We're going to keep going. See you next time.